Hello, and welcome to the Movie Universe. I'm your host, Movie Fan. Today, I'm playing Magic Sword. It's a real fun game full of adventure. Basically, it's just a 2D side-scroller where all you do is move to the right and you kill enemies as they come at you. But, as simple as it is, it's actually a lot of fun. What makes this game so interesting is the fact that you don't have to start on the first level. No, you really don't. I'm just going to pick something at random and go from there. On level 1, you basically, you're outside the castle, and you have to head towards it. You fight all kinds of monsters that get in your way. You kill them, you get all these coins, and you get some power-ups, like shields and keys. But keys, believe it or not, are actually very important, because you come across these locked doors, and there are people locked in there. You get all kinds of characters that can help you out, like this big guy with the axe, woman with a crossbow, a guy throwing hand grenades, basically. There are quite a few others, but there's too many of them to really count. And when you rescue these people, you walk by them, and they help you. Now, it's up to you as to who you want helping you, because believe it or not, they all have their strengths and they all have their weaknesses. Like, the big guy, he only throws the axe, and it's only good for, like, maybe a throw, and it takes too long for it to come back, so that makes him slow. The, the ninja, he has his shurikens, which are the weakest weapons, but he throws them really fast, so that's an advantage. So it really depends, like, what you want and who you want helping you. You keep going until you eventually come across a boss. Now, the bosses are very much similar in nature, but they, are, but they have a few variations. First level boss is a Chimera, who's a lot of fun to beat, by the way. Another level boss is a great Golden Dragon. Basically, the bosses are kind of repeated over and over again, but despite that, it's still fun because you got all these obstacles to work with. You got spikes, you got fire pits, the enemies have incredible magic powers, and really your main objective is to keep going up, 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 and up until you get to the final boss, which happens to be another Chimera. And when you beat these bosses, you actually get a more powerful sword each time. In fact, there's even times where you just go up another level and you get a more powerful sword. This is a type of game that I think everyone should play at least once. I mean, it's not exactly the most memorable game I've ever played, but... It's really fun. I don't know what it is. I often find that the most simplest of games can be the most fun. If you ever come across it, give it a try. I think you'll like it. This is Movie Fan, signing off.